Hi, this is the second part of the video. In order to perform the experiments, we only focus on the signs of this A and B column. For example, in order to perform this experiment first, we will keep the factor A at high level, B at low level. This experiment for this treatment, both A and B at high level. So the, this column sign will be used in order to perform the experiment. Then after that, what are this uh, A and B will help? A and B column signs will help to calculate the effects or they further, they help us to calculate the sum of scares. Further, what is this one small A, B and A, B? They are used for the, for the computation of contrast and effects and sum of scares. For the experiment that have both A and B at low level, we will mark it as one with the brackets. For the experiment that have A at plus and B at low level, it will be named as small a. Factor B at high level, A at low level, it will give us the effect of B and both at high level, it will give us the effect of interaction term AB. We can also represent these uh, two factor with two levels with the Cartesian coordinate, this graph. So in this graph, we have on the x-axis factor A, on the y-axis factor B. Along the x-axis, we have A at low level, then A at high level. This one is B at low level, B at high level. And this is A and B both are at high level. So in order to calculate the effect of A, what we will do, we will subtract this high level values, A at high level, these two values, minus these two values. So this is the way that how we can calculate the A. In order to calculate the effect of B, first of all, we will we will sum of, take the sum of these two values, B at high level, then subtract from B at low level. So for example, if it come out, comes out to be 10, it's comes out to be 4. So we can, we will do 10 minus 4. So this is the way that how we can calculate it. Now we will have, now we will have to calculate the main effect of A. For this, we will first have to calculate this term. This term is known as contrast of A. How we, we will calculate the contrast of A? For the A, you will have to use this table again. We know that in these two terms, A and B, the A is at high level. So we will keep this A and B with the plus sign, whereas the term in which A at low level, for example, this one, and this B. So we write those term with a negative sign for the contrast of A. After computing this contrast term, we will divide it by 2. Why we divide it by 2? Because there are two terms for with the plus sign and two terms with the negative sign. And then we multiply 2 by n. What is meant by this n? This n is multiplied by is, is meant by number of replications. How many times we have repeated the experiment? So what is meant by replication? For example, we have we have replicated the experiment twice. We got three values of the A. If the values are 2, 9 and 11. So in this case, all of these experiments will have three, three values of the response. So in this way, we have three in place of N. We have to compute this contrast for A, for B and AB. How we can calculate the contrast of the main, uh, the main effect of B? For again, we will have to first go for the contrast term of B. In order to calculate the contrast, what we will do? We will search for those term in which the B is at, high, as, is at high level or B have the sign of the plus. So if we see it here, the term B, it has B at plus level. The term AB, it has also B at plus level because with the term AB, uh, we will get uh, AB plus minus minus plus. Please remember there will be equal number of signs of minus and plus in each column. So we will have B plus there and there. So again, you can see the A, B term and the B term are with the plus sign, whereas A and 1 is at negative sign. Why? You can see it here that B in this column with 1 and B in this cell in front of A, you can see it had B has negative sign. So these two terms will become negative there. And again, we have divided by them two because there are two terms for the positive, two terms for the negative, and n is for the replication. So in this way, we have expression for the calculation of main effects.